Hello everyone, welcome to Milky Singh Academy. In today's video guys, I'm going to explain that how you can add images in a question paper using Edunext mobile technologies. So this is a complete video, so I'm going to explain how to add images in your question paper as well as in your option. So let's start this video guys. So guys, first of all, you have to open your web browser and type in the URL here you can see. And after that, you have to use your login ID and password. So maybe your login ID and uh, your school code may be different. So click on login button and you will be logged in into your Edunext mobile technologies here you can see. So here you have to click on e-learning as I have already made a complete video on how to create a question paper on Edunext. So this is the next part how you can add images. So after clicking on the teacher dashboard, you have these options here. You can see chapter and the next one is so I have already made. You can check that uh, the video in the description box I have added. So first you will create chapters and then question paper and at last you will create quizzes. So you can definitely check that video. I have uh, made a complete video on step by step manner how you can create a question paper. So adding images first so I will be making a demonstration for that and I will be creating the same step so I'm using the class here and I'm going to create a chapter here so in the, this computer subject here so maybe your subject are different so I'm going to add a chapter here so clicking on add chapter and here I'm going to select the academic year and the name of the chapter so for let me select this one here for adding images in question paper so the chapter name so let's add images only and after that click on save so this is going to add a chapter in your edu next so you can see the uh, images chapter has been created so now i'm going to add questions here so clicking on this question option here you can see at the bottom are all options here so clicking on that and i'm going to now clicking on add question so here I'm going to add question. So this is the objective type and difficulty level is medium. So marks is one and uh, maybe time required two minutes. So uh, why I'm going very fast here because I have already made a separate video for that. So this is only for adding the images in your question paper. So my question is uh, what is LAN networks? So I'm going to add a uh, images here. So and the options are also different options and different images for the different options so this is a objective type question so i'm going to click here and you can see the option for images here so as you can see image so clicking on that you will get these options so there are three tabs for image properties image tab links and upload so i'm going to upload a image so clicking on choose file so it will open my explorer here so i'm going to select this lan image here so when i select this image so let me click on that and clicking on open so it will open my image in the edu next website panel here so this teacher panel so you will see and you have to click on send it to the server option and now you will see the preview of your image so you can do a certain settings here if you want to decrease or increase the size so let me decrease the size let me make it 200 so maybe 200 is the proper size so there are other options like height and you can also add borders so if you want to add the border just click on one and two so it will add a border width here so a horizontal space so maybe you want to move the image to right or maybe vertical space so you can add uh, some numbers here so you will see the preview in the, this window here so alignment so i'm making it left so you can see the preview so if you are using multiple images in a single question so you have to do the same things so click on ok and uh, your image will be added here in your question so similarly you can add uh, images in your options so if you want to add options so you have to click here on the editor so when you click on the editor same window will open up and here you have to select the image and again you have to go to upload and uh, click on choose file so clicking on this option here so i have already uh, saved all the images similarly you have to do the same and click on send it to the server so this as you can see this image is a quite large image so i'm going to make it 100 so that it could fit in my op options so similarly you can make other images the same size so not uh, border i'm going to add one and i'm going to align it to the left so very simple so click on ok 
and similarly i will do the same things for the other options so you can also do that and uh, you can add any any size of image so just make it the same size that i'm making for the different images so if uh, you think that i'm going too fast you can watch my previous video in which i have explained all about how to create question paper a very step by step manner like uh, first you have to create the chapter and after creating chapter you have to add questions in the uh, chapter and uh, before after that you have to go to your question paper and you have to create question so at last you will be going to publish all your question papers on the quizzes so i have added all the four options so i'm making the third option a correct one and i'm not going to click on save so this question is going to save in my chapter so now the next step is i have to create a question paper out of this chapter so i'm going to click on this question paper option here at the left pane so you can see i have already made a chapter now the turn is for question paper so i'm going to click here on the question paper so i'm going to click on add question paper and i'm going to name it so you can so let me click again on the question paper okay so let me click on add question paper so here after clicking on add question paper it will ask for some things here so you have to write the name so i'm writing the question paper name is images so i'm selecting the class and the subject and maybe mark so that is two minutes so i'm going to select manual here and images is my chapter so objective type question medium type of difficulty level so question required is one duration is two minute and marks is one so after that click on save and next and now i have to select the questions so i'm going to click on plus and i'm going to select the question and clicking on save and next so this is how you can create a question paper out of a chapter so i have already made a separate video on that so you can check that out so clicking on save and close so you can see image question paper has been created so if i click on this three dot line and clicking on question pdf so you can see this is our question paper which is having images in it and all the options also having images so this is how guys you can create a images type of question paper using erunex mobile technology so that is all guys hope this video is somewhat helpful to you see you soon guys thanks a lot for watching this video bye bye